Eggs are really strong if you press them along their long axis. Have you ever wondered why egg cartons pack all the eggs standing up? Maybe circular cross sections pack better than oval shaped cross sections would. Maybe the carton packing is a testament to how the eggs come out of a chicken. No, that's not practical enough. Eggs are incredibly strong when they're pressed along their major axis. And that has to do with the material and the geometry of eggshells. Eggshells are made out of calcium carbonate, which is a ceramic. Meaning that when it's being pressed, it's really strong under compression. But when it's being pulled apart, it's really, really weak. With this eggshell fragment, the bending is pushing the top together, but it's pulling the bottom apart, making it easy to snap. However, in an intact egg being pressed from the top and the bottom, no part of the egg surface is under tension. It's all being pressed. The shape of an egg is like two domes with their basis combined by a hoop, or you can think about it as Humpty Dumpty's belt. This allows eggs to take advantage of the fact that materials don't break under a given force. They break under a stress, so force divided by area. And the geometry of a dome distributes the given force over the whole surface of the egg, rather than just a given point. However, when you're cracking an egg on a pan, you're only hitting a little bit of the surface so you can manage to break the egg. However, if you line the egg up along the edge, the cracks propagate less predictably, and it usually ends up pretty messy. This is because domes resist fracture, and they usually have to bulge out at the base in order to break. So the elegant way that domes distribute force combined with the inherent compressive strength of calcium carbonate form a remarkably strong structure that is a safe home for developing chicks or secure packaging for nutrition. Packing eggs standing upright in cartons keeps most of them from cracking during shipping and handling from the farm or hen house to the store and eventually to your home. No food was wasted in the making of this video, it all went to the animals. Additionally, if you do try this at home, do not apply the uniaxial force with an uneven surface pressing on the egg, or else it will cause cracking, like you can see here. That's not what we expected, actually, at all. Thanks for watching, and you're welcome to send any questions my way.